Good afternoon, dear viewers. I am happy to welcome you on Savalmash channel. This is Alexander Sudarev, and we are on the construction site. Behind me, you see the result of work of a huge number of people, a huge number of teams. Engineers, designers were working on building this facility. Builders, construction directorate, planning and economic department, all participants of the Savalmash project, and the results are really trustworthy. It inspires confidence that everyone who is engaged in that knows how to do their work, when to do it and why to do it. And you know, today is not a simple day. The 25th of May is the day when the time capsule was laid. A year has passed since that event. And now on your screens you will see what the construction site looked back then. And in this video we will show you what it looks now, what has changed, which work is being conducted today. Let's have a look at it. the building, I'm sure that many of you have seen it, and most work to close the thermal contour is finished. Most enclosing barriers have been mounted. The second floor has lots of interroom partitions on it. And let's actually look from a different angle. You can see metal construction here, which were brought on the construction site. And in the back part of the building, where there is the warehouse, they are just lying there modestly. What are they? They are a little bit different from what we saw before. They are anti-fire stairs, which will be mounted here, near the administrative building, on these four concrete foundations. Well, the cameraman will try to show it to you. It is not very visible. A red glue lamp, it will have corporate colors. It will look really good. And I think that in the near future we will be able to see the final result, what it will look like in the mounted version of it. In this part of the building, and by the way, a parking lot will be here for employees' cars. And the part where a wall is missing. It is not only done for builders to be able to lift the necessary materials, partitions through that area. Quite a big gate is going to be there, which will be meant for lifting the necessary equipment, technological production equipment, materials and many other things. They will be lifted on the territory of the Commission building. It is already allowed for in the documents. All of that will be here. So equipment of building is quite solid. Now the cameraman will show you a bird's eye view. Look at the enclosing barriers. Most of them have already been mounted. The thermal contour is being closed. Glazing is being mounted. And we see a small number of open windows, I mean, the ones which are missing. 
Despite that, I can share some information with you. The warehouse and experiment and production part of the building have been almost fully glazed. And the apertures, which you see instead of window frames, they are meant for later mounting ventilation grids there, which are necessary for proper work of relevant equipment. So work goes on. Most of the grades have already been brought on the construction site there in the warehouse. And I hope that very soon we will be able to show you what they will look like on their places. As for the administrative building, it is worth noting that most enclosing barriers have almost been mounted, glazing is being done, it is not yet fully performed. Glazing of the bay window started, window frames as well. Mounting of glassworks is being conducted now. It looks quite imposing. I am standing here and I am looking at the result, which is being achieved and looks quite nice, I must tell you. Simply speaking, looks great. And I think that when the builders finish mounting and scaffolding will be demounted, we will be able to really appreciate the exterior looks of it. As for roof work, as of today, roof above the production building and the warehouse building, roof work has been done. Thermal insulation has been laid. As for the administrative building, the interior, the lower layer of the roof has been mounted. Now the frame will be put there where thermal insulation will be placed. And this stage is going to happen very soon. Work is done very quickly. Very soon we will see what it will look like. There is a lot of work going on concerning utility lines, air heaters are being installed and other equipment in the specially allocated zones, ventilation shafts as well, but that will happen later. As of today, a year has passed and we see the thermal contour which has been closed. The bearing constructions, that is the metallic frame has been mounted. Partitions of the first and the second floor have been poured. Concrete pixel, you can see it on your screens. Subconcrete work in the extensions to the right of the building is being performed. And I think that you can now see it on the screens as well. We can draw one conclusion from it. Construction is going on at quite a good pace. And today it is directly impacted by financing, which is coming in. The result of work, which we can see in terms of construction and in terms of development that we spoke about in our previous videos, which is now done on rented areas where the main capacities of Savalmash are placed, all of that means that the teams that implement the technical part of the project, the construction part of the project, they are all professionals. And these people understand what to do, when to do it and why to do it. And basically this facility could have already been built. However, we understand the current situation. And again, terms of construction are directly impacted by how quickly the invested funds come in. And today each participant of the project can influence when this facility will be commissioned this Design and Technological Bureau, Savalmash. I think that further comment is not needed here. Do follow our news, be in the know of what is happening in the life of the project. Share this news with those who are interested in that, for whom it is important, and I'm sure that a lot of new achievements, a lot of new tasks are in store for us in the future that will be implemented very quickly and in a very efficacious way, and that will bring its fruit. Have a good day, see you very soon.